Hey, what's going on, guys? So I want to talk about Lucas Lee Tyson's course where he teaches you how to create your own digital course and uh, create your own YouTube ads and then sell a digital product. A uh, couple things that I want to point out is, you know, selling a digital course is a pretty dope business model on the internet because you're selling a digital product. So there's no inventory there's no cost of goods when you're trying to scale, uh, you know, because with a digital product, you can duplicate it over and over and over again at zero cost. So the, these are some of the huge advantages of uh, selling a digital course. Trust me, I would know because my entire success on the internet comes from selling a digital products. So for example, I first got started in 2014 uh, doing the local lead generation business model where we build and rank our own lead generation websites at the top of Google search engine, generate free traffic and sell leads to uh, a local service provider, local business owners like you know, your towing companies, plumbers, roofing companies. And, and that's a, a lead is a digital product because there's no cost of goods. So it is so much more scalable than an e-com business or a brick and mortar business. Uh, and then, you know, four or five years into that business, I transitioned. Uh, I'm still running the Legion business, but I've also now partnered with our the coach of that program that I joined, uh, Dan Klein. And I also, um, am now focused on promoting the coaching program, which is a, a digital product. And so I just want to point out, you know, some of the differences between like a lead gen business, uh, and like selling a digital course. Now for Lucas, um, the, one of the challenges he's going to face when uh, teaching students is that, you know, not all the students are able, are going to be able to create a really awesome digital program. Um, Dan already had, you know, eight years experience before he even started uh, coaching other people. Um, Lucas, I understand his story was that he used to work for a digital marketing company and this by working for this company, uh, he learned how to run some Facebook ads. And after like a year or so in 2022, he decided to package what he knew about Facebook ads into a, a program and he started running face uh, YouTube ads with it. Um, I think he was able to see a lot more success back in 2022 because YouTube ads were uh, way less competitive back then. Uh, there's way less people running YouTube ads, so people were able to turn profit pretty quickly. Um, but I think the challenge is today, it's gotten a lot more competitive, meaning there's just more advertisers running, trying to sell their own digital products on YouTube. So, you know, as time goes on, as c competition goes up, um, you in my opinion, you do have to create a great course. You know, there's people that will make reviews about your course on YouTube and different platforms. If your course is not good, you will get negative reviews. And so it's not as easy as, hey, you know, anybody can make a training program and, and start making, you know, six, seven figures. Um, you know, with a course, you also need to provide a lot of ongoing support. So it's not a, it's not that passive. Local lead generation is a lot more passive because uh, you can build and rank a website and once it's ranked, it just keep, it'll just keep generating leads for a local service provider and you can just leave it alone and, and that website will keep making money. Uh, whereas a course, even if you were to get, you know, X, Y, Z amount of sales in a month, you still have to provide ongoing support for all your students that you um, get into the program. So in, in that regard, um, running a program is way less passive. So, you know, it's something that you, you, you're going to have to put ongoing effort and ongoing energy into to maintain and, and to maintain good results and reputation with your students. So it should be something that you're actually passionate about. Um, and again, if you don't have any expertise in any area that you can package into a course, uh, you're somebody that probably isn't a good fit for Lucas Lee Tyson's program. You're probably more better fit to, to 
uh, do like our program, like local lead generation, becoming like a local marketer and helping small businesses get more customers from the internet because there's still a huge demand for that skill. Uh, because you know, with that skill, it's so versatile. You can go into any city uh, all across the country. You know, in the U.S. alone, there's like 1,500 different cities that you can go into, and each city there's like 50 different niches that you can go into. So you're gonna have plenty of opportunity to opportunities to make 10k 20k a month of residual passive income when you know how to when you know how to uh, be a great lead generator in in in, in the local market um, with that being said um, if you do have a, a deep passion for something a, a particular subject and you feel like you can help a lot of people um, and you're somebody that's not afraid to get on camera I know Lucas says you can hire somebody uh, to be on camera but I still think the main coach um, has to make connection with the audience and you're not afraid of being on camera. Uh, you're very passionate and, and, and an expert in a particular subject. I think uh, there is some opportunities for you to create a course, but just know that um, with Lucas's business model, you do have to run paid traffic, which is YouTube ads. And YouTube ads means you have to put your own credit card on file and, and run uh, and pay pay for clicks, pay for view, viewership, pay, pay for reach. So you really can't come into this business um, and be be completely broke and or have a very tight budget and expect to succeed. Um, and that's another challenge of this business model is it's really difficult to test this business model because in the beginning you don't have a program and you, you're going to have to spend time invest your time in creating an entire program and then start running ads and then see if you're going to be profitable or, or not the big risk there is you after you spent all that time creating a course and you create an ad and you, and you realize over time uh, it's not pro being profitable or you're barely breaking even, you could run into a situation where you've kind of wasted a bunch of time and you created a product that's not um, being profitable because, you know, anyone can package like a 15, 20 hour program, but that does not mean um, you can just straight up run ads to it and it's going to it's going to be profitable guaranteed um, again running paid traffic is highly competitive there's a lot of other players out there that also have really good programs that they're running ads for and a lot of them have really high budget as well so they can operate on really slim margins and still able to run ads so if you're somebody that's kind of living paycheck to paycheck right now um, relying on a business model that relies on paid traffic might be extremely difficult because with paid traffic, you could there's like 10, 20 factors that could make an ad not be profitable. And so it does take a lot of testing, and a lot of split testing uh, when it's not profitable to make it profitable. And that takes some time. And when, when it takes some time, you might be losing money your first couple weeks or maybe even a couple months and you still have to endure that and keep testing. So you do need some funds uh, in just the paid traffic alone. Um, at the very least, like you're gonna have to like risk, you know, 10, 15, 20 grand in my opinion to really test ads and funnels and, and make sure um, you can do all the split testing necessary to make a funnel or a product profitable on, on with using YouTube ads. So just be warned on that. Um, and again, if you're interested, if you're somebody that, you know, doesn't have the expertise or you're just somebody that wants a much easier or simpler business model to get to 10, 20 K a month of residual passive income, then I, I highly recommend checking out local lead generation. I left the link in the description. See you in the next video.